Hey guys, today I have a really cool camera and it's the Polaroid 450 pack camera that takes Fujifilm FP100C and black and white film. On the back of the box is how many minutes you need to let this stuff set after you've taken the photo. Instructions will vary depending on temperature. You adjust the lighten and darken ring on the front to get a lighter or darker picture. And as you can see, you can also adjust settings by using the little tab at the bottom. Also, the ISO wheel is right beside that. It only goes to 75 on this camera, so put it on 75 and lighten on the ring and you should be good to go. Pull down on this little switch, then hit the lever at the top, and you've taken a photo. Mine has a timer, but I don't use it. My battery's also been modded to where I can use a 123 battery. Press down on the top lever and push in. That's all it takes to get your camera back into its normal position. Press up on the lever on the front and your camera will automatically pop out itself. Don't pull too hard or you might mess up the bellows. Now in order to adjust your view, you will move the two levers on the front. This is a rangefinder camera so you'll be able to see through the viewfinder what your image will look like. Now at first, my images turned out a bit dark because I was indoors and I was using the wrong settings. I had it on darken and I wasn't using a tripod. After using a tripod, I found out that my images looked a whole lot better and I popped the setting on the front up to lighten a little bit and they turned out great. Outdoors, even better. Now we're going to shoot some film and watch it develop. It's a pretty simple process. Once you get the film out of its pack, insert it into your camera. This is really the hardest part though. Between uses, you might want to check your rollers to make sure that they're clean. That way you get a good even spread over your image and everything turns out good. Make sure you insert the film into your camera to where all the flaps are able to be pulled on if necessary. The black one's the first one that you need to pull. Sometimes they break. In fact, that happens quite often with this camera. Open it slightly and pull out a little bit more if you have to. Try not to expose any of the film though. Same goes for the white flap. After you've taken your photo, just pull that out. Yeah, it can prove to be difficult sometimes and then pull the one below it once it comes out. Now you just have to wait. I use the timer on my phone. After about two minutes, the image is ready to be peeled apart from the negative. Be careful not to touch any of the chemicals that might have spilled out. My image turned out a little bit dark because I had it on the darken setting instead of lighten but look how cool that negative turned out. Bad news is you're gonna to wanna to throw away your negative because it's got chemicals on it that you really don't wanna to touch. And if you do touch them, be sure to wash your hands immediately. That's the Polaroid 450. Really cool, brilliant pack camera.